No. I would now like to introduce contestant number 18, Lim Penny, A Simple Change. A Simple Change, Lim Penny. You are late again! How many times have you heard this phrase? It might have been once, or twice, or even a hundred times. Well, these four words haunted me my entire life. As a kid, I was late to everything. So when I was at home, I would get scolded. And when I was at school, I, was, I would also get scolded. It all begins with my mom in the morning. Penny, why you haven't finished preparing for school? Were you sleeping just now? No? Actually, I was sleeping until I heard my mom's footsteps outside my door. Anyway, a great start to the morning. But do you think that's all? Of course! Not because when I went to school, guess what? My second mother appeared right in front of me. Penny, why are all your homework answers so rushed? What were you doing yesterday? Gaming up or scrolling your phone, is it? No? Actually, I was gaming. I was playing Roblox with my friends until 12 a.m. in the morning. As you can all see, I was not the role model student. Time management, a sleep schedule, what's that? Forget about it. I was always procrastinating. To be honest, I tried, I tried, and I tried over and over again, but I just couldn't change. Was it really that hard to just get a little better? One day, my sister came up to me and told me this. Penny, sitting in your bed doing nothing all day, you will not gain anything. Why won't you leave your comfort zone and change for the better? Let me ask you this. If you don't change now, will you ever change later? She was right. I mean, sure, I was annoyed, but if I didn't do anything to change this bad habit, when will I do it? Little did I know, everything would change with one simple effort the following day. It was 8 p.m. at night, and I walked up to my desk like I always did, and I reached for my phone. That's when it hit me. Wait, what if I did my homework now so I wouldn't get scolded tomorrow? Or what if I slept earlier now so I wouldn't get scolded tomorrow? What if I never had to get scolded again? That was when I decided to pull on my homework and I started writing. No, this time I was not rushing before the deadline. And when I was done, I put my homework into my bag and I went to sleep. Not at 2 a.m., not at 12 a.m., but 10 p.m. at night. Can you all guess what time I woke up the next morning? 6 a.m. I, it was such a small, simple achievement, but you know what? I felt proud of myself. Following that day, everything started coming together. I stopped rushing my homework late at night, and I stopped waking up late in the afternoon like I always did. Along with all these problems, I could feel everyone's nagging voices around me grow softer every day. Until it stopped. One fine day, it was time for school again. Penny, if you haven't wake up, I'm going to... Oh! You're early this time. Not bad, not bad. Well, 
You better stay this way. Ladies and gentlemen, we all face challenges. There are times when you will struggle and there are times when you will fall. But in order to overcome all these challenges, it all begins with one simple change from you. Thank you.